Okay, so here is one of the things I'm most happy about in terms of the automation bits. So I'm going to come outside being careful not to let the gate shut and lock me out. And here is my Ubiquiti G4 doorbell. Now, you press the doorbell, makes a nice ring like that. Now, if I was to head inside a little bit, so what happens when we do that? Well, a couple of things. So number one, my phone is going to tell me that there's someone at the door and I can switch on, slick, switch, flick, on over to the Ubiquiti Protect mobile app, which will allow me to see someone at the door no matter where I am. And I can then talk to them, have a two-way conversation because there's a speaker and a microphone in the doorbell. And then the other thing that happens, and we're gonna to have to emulate this by jumping onto my iPad, is back here in the kitchen where the Sonos is, we'll get this. Ring, 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 ring. There's someone at the door. Now I've been told this is getting annoying. <laughs> However, the point is, is that the doorbell ringing triggers an event. So the Ubiquiti Unify Protect integration with Home Assistant can catch that event. And of course that's now trigger. So I can then cause something else to happen as a result. And in this case, I'm just doing text to speech over to there. I don't need to push anything to my watch or my phone because both of those will go off with the native Unify Protect app, which allows me to have the two way conversation. And then this just happens in parallel. So this avoids me having to have a chime box or anything else sort of running cables from the door back to here. It's literally just everything's happening over IP, which is pretty cool.